Hi, it's Candy here. So I, I just got back just to say, just now, what time is it? Not even in the afternoon, from an elopement. I love elopements. Now, if you don't know what elopement is, elopement is wedding that happens sort of short notice often or without anyone knowing or is very small and just they sort of almost do it on a whim but more or less they plan it it's not really a whim. and they're one of my favorite things to photograph i love photographing weddings as a freelance photographer i'm in charge of my own diary and that gives me some great flexibility and elopements are just superb well i got the first contact from the couple was actually last night and they weren't going to have a photographer then they were like no maybe we should and they had a look around and she said the first thing that sprung out to her from my photography was that i really got what they were about but i love elopement and i'm going to tell you why elopement photography is just one of the greatest ways to learn your craft but first i gotta get coffee couples sometimes don't want the stress and the politics and often the awkward family situations that comes with but putting on a wedding and so when they trust you as a, as a as a photographer to do their elopement it's quite a big deal like it is with any wedding couple but this is where they hope that you blend in with their day without causing them any anxiety or any issues because for a lot of elopements in my experience have been for people who just don't want to be that much for center attention on their wedding day the thought of walking down an aisle with everyone staring at them is a little too much so when you do your when you work as a elopement photographer quite often you find yourselves being one of very few people in attendance which means you have to really up your craft in knowing great angles to get enough images from two people it's like it's almost like an extended couple session and you have to get all the the nuances of what goes with a wedding so the first kiss exchanging of rings but then you also have to think about getting the memory and one of the great things i focus on is getting the landscape of where they're getting married or if um, one couple got, um, had their wedding up a mountainside so i got them walking up and all that um the other thing with elopements it's rare you'll be able to share them normally you can share long after the event but i have found a lot of couples don't want them shared uh it's because they want to keep it just for their family um and they don't want them on social media but also uh, elopements happen they need to take time to tell their family what they've done so yeah that can sometimes come up i have found more and more people are doing elopement, elopements more and more people are going that way i love a good wedding don't get me wrong but there's something about elopements that are just to make me feel a bit more badass <laughs> a little bit more uh, i don't know just a little bit more something else and they are great fun you have to you have to be really quick though because so often elopements are short notice um and what is that mark on my jacket <laughs> elopements are short notice people uh want it don't want to be bogged down with those paperwork you need to make sure everything's in order so i basically send a file across they sign it it comes back that's it sometimes you won't know uh, exactly what's going to happen on the day so it's a lot of thinking on your own not like thinking i think it's thinking on the foot or thinking off the hoof whatever they call it a lot of elopements are can be an obscure location uh obviously some people do the legal side uh in do the legal side in the registry office and then they'll go have an officiate do it somewhere else or they'll do the officiate side then and then go do the legal side later on so they can have like their little elopement which is the which isn't legally binding but then means more so they go do it that way uh, some just can people just do it themselves at registry office and they don't tell anybody because they just don't want the rigmarole of planning a wedding budget requirements um or situations that they find themselves in one couple sadly who have allowed me to share this story with you had lost uh, their child and they decided that they just wanted to be married and and that was it they just wanted to be married now and they didn't want to do they didn't feel right having a big celebration and it was beautiful honestly it was probably one of the most beautiful things i've seen and it was just them saying they're going to be forever together and it was just wonderful and it doesn't take away from weddings where you have all the cake and the first dance because they're amazing but elopements are something i really do love and i treasure quite a lot because that is if someone saying to you that this is a huge deal for us a huge secret and we trust you to capture it Elopements are great fun. Don't be scared of doing an elopement. Um, they have the same level of awesomeness as a normal wedding. It's often a lot shorter and in a more random locations and you will be quite alone on it. I rarely have shot an elopement where they've requested an assistant. The whole point of elopement is there's less people. My eyes watering. Oh. Um, <laughs> less people and they want to keep it that way. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment below what you love about elopements or if you've had an elopement or want an elopement, what you would be doing. Isn't that great? I love elopements. Maybe I should elope, although I'm not engaged though. Yeah. 
These fingers are bare. That's not a hint, by the way. Not a hint. It's not a hint. Bye.